YouTube is your boy Musa back with another vlog. Um, this vlog is gonna be an interesting one because I have decided to show you guys a full week of eating. Now, not necessarily a full week because it is kind of a Tuesday today, but I'm gonna show you a full week of eating from today up until Sunday, um, what I eat throughout the day, every single day for a whole week. Sounds exciting, right? It's pretty boring, but you're gonna watch it anyways. Let's make breakfast. It's around two o'clock. I'm about to make my fuss and I just came up from the gym and I'm hungry. Boom. So here we have it, meal number one. You have different types of people. You have people that eat eggs without ketchup. I'm one of those that eat eggs with ketchup. Um, so, two of you guys have two whole eggs, 160 grams of egg whites. We've got 60 grams of oats with a scoop of whey protein. And yeah, some salt and some pancake syrup in here. Good, make it taste good. Um, and yeah, that's breakfast done and now it's vacuum time let's go Oh, meal two, as you saw, I got some KFC. I got a Zinger burger. I've got some one piece chicken and some bites. Um, this is around thousand calories. I did put it in my fitness pal. Um, this is the beauty about intermittent fasting. It's a chance for me to, like if I'm craving something, I can fit it into my macros. This is not, actually this is pretty high protein considering like the protein balance is it's pretty balanced throughout it's like i've hit my protein for today like i've always put my meals in first thing in the morning um breakfast and dinner the one in the middle lunch is like i don't know what i'm gonna eat uh i can change it around and today as you guys see i felt like having kfc i don't know why i just feel like having kfc i've been thinking about kfc the last couple of days i don't know why i've been craving kfc but here it is i'm gonna munch on this um and then get some more work done and then we're gonna have my final meal around like eight o'clock right now it's towards six so you can call this dinner but well, I don't go to sleep until like one two so this is not my dinner this is lunch and uh, consider I broke my fast around 2 30 this is lunch um, so yeah let me eat and I'll catch you guys for the final meal was like 500 calories i can't remember i just i just know I, yeah 500 calories my breakfast which leaves a ton of space a ton of yeah ton of space for me to eat what i want um and here it is this meal went away pretty fast you know quick six seven hundred was well, eight nine hundred calories um thousand plus five hundred it's a thousand five i still have 
around 800 calories to play with for the rest of the day and I stop eating normally around like 8 o'clock I'm not one of those people that can eat six meals a day no that's not me I don't do them things two three at max three at max I never eat like four or five meals I can't do it I just can't um, I'm always working and when I get in my work I'm in the zone I don't really think about food like that um, but yeah that's it I'll see you guys for the final meal Today is a Wednesday, this is meal number one. We've got two pieces of chicken, We've got like 350 grams of potatoes and an endless amount of okra. Why okra? Because it's my favorite veg and it's easy to eat. So yeah, meal number one, about to go down. Vacuum time! <sighs> Meal number two, we've got some salmon. So first thing I'm gonna do, I'm not eating now. I'm gonna get some lemon juice, lime juice, lemon. Put it in there with the salmon. Quite a lot, because I like I like fish that is sour. I think most people do, right? Do that. Squeeze another lime in there. Oh yeah. Good stuff. Bam. And finally, add a good amount of salt. A good amount of salt to really get in the soul. And then we're gonna add a bit of Garlic powder as well. Why not? Boom. And that should do it. You can add a bit of basil if you want to, just a little bit. Just give it a little extra something, something. But yeah. Aromata, just a little bit, and then we're good. That's all I need up in there. So now, tie it up. Here, tighten it up. Really, really get it up in there. Like that. That's that good stuff. Boom. And now I'm going to put it in the fridge and let it sit. Let that sit for about two hours by the time I'm done with my work and everything and then put it in the oven. It's gonna come out looking juicy. Cook that with a little bit of butter. Oh my God. Meal number two, we have oats with a scoop of protein and we have a protein bar. Um, light, you know, yam on this and get back to work. It's time for me to have my final meal. I'm gonna go to the gym again to do cardio. Um, it's pretty nice weather actually. It's not looking too bad, like you guys can see. It's not looking too bad. The windows are messed up. Ugh, there you go. Look at that window. Ugh. But anyways, I'm gonna have some rice with some salmon and some asparagus. Let me put this together and I'll show you guys how it looks. So today is day Thursday. Today is Thursday. Um, as you can see, I've done 16, almost 16 and a half hours basically. Um, I'm gonna end my fast now with the first bite. Let me do the first bite. Mm -hmm. 10 days in a row. Um, I was doing work and I woke up in the morning, reaction videos, finished off on a drawing, and I got to send off my client work. Yeah, breakfast, the same, two hot eggs, 
110 grams of egg whites. Today I got 70 grams of oats, um, scuba protein. Um, why 70 instead of 60? I don't know, you just feel like it. And also I wore legs today, so I'm eating before I go my workout. I normally do my workout first, fasted, just because i am still got fuel from the food I ate the day before, um, and I don't feel hungry when I, first, when I wake up early in the morning. Whereas today I've woken up, I've been up for quite a long time, about four hours, doing work and whatnot. Um, so I'm low on energy and if I'm going to hit legs, I want to give it my everything. So I'm going to eat this, finish off my work and all that stuff. And once I'm done with my work, which should take at least like an hour. Um, by the time I get to the gym, that's like an hour and a half after I've eaten my food. I'm ready to, to go and knock out the leg workout. So that is the plan. Let me eat our breakfast and I will catch you guys for lunch time. Let's go. Eggs first, always. And ketchup. Vacuum time! So here I am, second meal of the day, coming to you at 823 calories, 58 grams of protein, 34 fat, 71 carbs, good macros there. Um, as you can see, it's a big bowl. Um, this could easily be up to be split up to two meals. You can usually separate it. By the time now, it's actually eight o'clock, um, pretty late. I've just come back from the gym, had to whip it up. Um, I like my food fresh because I work from home, so it makes sense to make my food fresh. Or I could prep the grounded beef and that, but nah, I like cooking fresh food. Um, yeah, 800 calories, you're getting all of this food. It's, it's a lot of volume, as you can see how much veggies I put in there. I ain't tracking my veggies right now. Um, the only thing I put in was the okra, but all the carrots and all that stuff. Not really, I, didn't, I, don't, I don't track those. Um, it's just, you know, I feel like when it comes to dieting, keep it consistent. Um, unless I was like competing or something like that, they'll get to a point where I have to start tracking vegetables and all that stuff. But at this stage right now, we're only like in the beginning stages um, of the diet. Um, so I'm not counting veggies. And I probably won't count veggies throughout until I get to a point where I'm like, I'm plateauing. Maybe now it's time to actually start tracking veggies, salt, all that stuff. Um, the key is just consistency. You've got to keep everything consistent um, throughout, you know, how much salt you're using. If you start using that much salt from the beginning, keep it that way. When you start thinking, seeing things stop, maybe reduce your calories, increase cardio before you start attacking your food. Um, try and give yourself as much nutrition and food you can. Um, and as you can see, the only thing that really came out of like a package that was processed was the sausage. Um, the chicken chicken sausage aside from that everything else is as it is you know grounded beef is grounded beef there's no other e numbers yada 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 it's grounded beef rice is rice vegetables are vegetables that's it um i put some like zero calorie sh sugars and whatnot um zero calorie sauces which i bought um they're pretty good just to add a little bit of flavor to it salt kept it same and yeah pretty late like i said eight o'clock my first meal was around 2 30 so i'm hungry that's around like what six hours ago damn i was like yeah one hour and i'm gonna go gym no i ended editing the vlog a set of my drawings um, and all that stuff even uploaded a video so yeah that's why i'm eating now but i wasn't hungry so that that meal did keep me full for a while 
So it was good that I added an extra 10 grams of oats today. But let me eat, let me vacuum this and I'll catch you guys later on um, for the final meal. That's if I'm hungry. I still got 900 plus calories to play with. I don't, I don't know when I'm gonna be hungry, probably like 11 o'clock, but it is what it is. Let me eat. And we're about to break our fasts around like 1.30. Today I'm thinking a nice juicy omelette, maybe put in a tortilla wrap to get them carbs in. Um, but yeah, let's make breakfast. I'm hungry. There we are, meal number one, egg to the wraps. Good stuff, could do with some salt, but it is what it is, I can eat it without. I'd, I like to have a pretty high fat meal in the morning simply because it keeps me full for a very long time to the point where I don't have to eat for another two, three hours. I'm gonna eat this, do a bit of editing, and then head to the gym for shoulders and arms, which I'm looking forward to. I'm always looking forward to a shoulder dominated workout. I only do like four, four exercises for arms. So two biceps, two triceps, and I do like four exercises for shoulders um, the bicep and triceps are normally superset and yeah but that's not the point of the video today's this video is all about eating um, let me eat this and I'll catch you guys later so here I am about to eat my second meal I just come back from the gym showered up and everything I've got grounded beef and rice with a ton of vegetables that's pretty much it I love this meal you can see a lot of volume. Mm -mm -mm. Catch you a lot later for meal three. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Oh my god! So here we are, final meal of the day. We have two uh, chicken thighs, skinless. I took the skin off. Um, got potatoes around two hundred and eighty-eight grams. Um, and to hit my protein, I've got a scoop of protein, whey protein, just to help me hit my pro uh, protein. Um, I'm not that hungry to be honest, I'm not gonna lie. Um, and I've also got all this water to drink down. Um, as you guys noticed, or all you haven't noticed, I don't really eat fruit. Like I hardly ever eat fruit. I know some fruits have good nutritional value, yadi yadi yadi. I just don't eat fruit. <laughs> But yeah, let me get the eating and I will catch you guys tomorrow for breakfast. Mm -mm -mm. If you're wondering the sauce, that's some zero, well, low calorie sauces that I've got. And sriracha sauce. Yeah, yeah. Good. Today is a Saturday. Um, first minute of the day coming at 2.40. Um, it's around 734 calories, um, give or take. Um, 
61 grams of protein. I went for a really high protein breakfast. Um, 38 fat, good amount of fats as well, with a yolk and whatnot. And got some fat in the chicken. And I put cheese in the omelette um, and 36 carbs. So pretty low carb breakfast, very high protein. The reason why I'm doing this today is because I am spending the afternoon, evening with um, Zoe's family. So I'm going to her house um, to spend that time with the family. So I don't know what I'm gonna expect there when it comes to food. So it makes sense that I eat a high protein meal first, um, just to make sure I get at least 60 grams of protein. Um, I might even drink a protein shake before I go as well. So that gives me another 30, 40 grams of protein. And when I go there, I see what I can see because I know it's going to be carb heavy. Um, it's Afghan food, you know, you've got, you've got the rices, potatoes, but you also have protein. You have good my meat, so it depends. I don't know what I'm expecting, but I just thought, you know what, make sure I, I go there. Okay. Um, so yeah, let me eat this before it gets cold. Today I decided to add some baked beans, which I normally don't, but we added some baked beans to add some carbs into the meal. Um, yeah, bon appetit. So today we're gonna to talk about what happened yesterday after I came home from Zoe's place. Um, what did I eat there? I had Afghan rice with some Afghan uh, beef sauce, which was tomatoes, onions, a bit of oil, um, which was good. Um, I didn't have that much. I had around like 200, 250 grams of rice. Not that bad. That's what I eat like normally on a day. Um, the beef as well, I had like a 100, 150 grams of that. And there was chicken, so I had like a chicken leg, uh, which I have as well on the daily that was grilled. So that wasn't that crazy. Um, had some skin on it, um, which was extra fat as well, but it was protein. And I had some mixed salad on the side. Um, after that, there, were, there was like a snack there that was made out of uh, milk. Milk, sugar. Um, it's like an Afghan snack with some pistachios and almonds in it. Again, good fats and some protein there. Um, and yeah, man, um, that's pretty much all I had and tea and water. I, didn't, I don't drink fizzy drinks and stuff like that. Aside from energy drinks, uh, which I'm kind of addicted to, but that's a topic for another day. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much what I had yesterday. Then, no, that's not yet. That's what I had in the house. <laughs> um, I walked home from there, which took around an hour. So that's an extra steps, calories burnt. I walked around 17,000 steps yesterday, which is mm, 6,000 steps more than what I normally do um, and I came home I was hungry because I ate that meal around six o'clock so I got home around one I uh, went to McDonald's got a mix box I ate half of it and I gave half to my little brother and I also had a strawberry cheesecake Ben and Jerry's why because I felt like it and I wanted it so I had it very simple uh, my brother got one as well um, and yeah that's why yesterday currently now it's 4 30 in the afternoon um, and I still haven't eaten so I've been fasting for a very long time around 16 16 and a half hours. I'm still not hungry. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie um, So I'm just gonna wait. Um, it is Sunday today. So I'm probably gonna have a nice little cheat meal um, Today, I don't know what I'm feeling but I'm gonna order order something um, When I'm hungry, but right now I'm not so I'm gonna wait just drink water 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 is extremely hot today It's around 22 degrees I don't like the heat, I literally just came back from watching my little brother play, um, not the smallest one, the one in the middle, um, and I walked all the way home. So I'm on. I'm already on, what, 12,000 steps for the day and it's only four o'clock. So I still have to go to the gym, do cardio, um, some, I'm gonna do like skipping and stuff like that today. Um, it is Sunday, like I said, so it is a rest day. Um, so I'm just gonna go do cardio, skipping, Maybe some push-ups, pull-ups, and that kind of stuff. Um, some of you probably thinking that's a workout, so eh, you can call it what it is. Um, I class it as a rest day because I'm not lifting extremely heavy weight. Um, but yeah, that is the plan for today. Um, I'm not. I don't think I'm going out again aside from the gym. I don't like heat. I hate heat. Sleep is very uncomfortable these last two days. With the fan on, windows open, it's just not it. It's just I love winter. Bring me winter back. I know some people go, hey, what, are you crazy? What? I love winter breath. 
waking up to a cup of tea come on man please ain't that better than that i'll catch you guys later so today's meal we've got a flame zinger burger kfc within the kfc thing um and we've got some wings here well my brother's gonna cook up some of these because i'm not gonna eat all this um but yeah got six wings two piece chicken and four bites i'm probably gonna have three four i'm gonna have the bites the piece chicken and about two wings and the other four wings i'm gonna give to him he can eat um but yeah this is my only meal today um it's currently what six or seven 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 o'clock and i haven't eaten the whole day so yeah this is gonna be my only meal today and maybe a protein shake once i come back from the gym later on cool bye Oh! <laughs> Final milk today. Um, two scoops of whey protein in here. We got three eggs and some egg whites. Um, another high protein, low carb meal. Um, the reason why I'm doing that is simply because of the extra carbs I had yesterday with the McDonald's and the Ben and Jerry's. So today I've just really focused on protein and getting in some fats as well. Um, but yeah, this is all I'll be eating for the rest of the night um putting our week to a conclusion technically not we still got tomorrow so i'll i'll add in tomorrow as well to make it a full week um surround it up because we started on tuesday so i'll do tomorrow as well to make it a full week but tomorrow my calories will be going down by a hundred um i'm reducing my calories at a hundred every week for now they will get to a point where i'm like nope i'm not going any lower than this i'll just have to increase cardio my steps, water intake, all that stuff. Um, but yeah, for now, I'll reduce calories nice and slow. And yeah, let me eat this and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Today is the final day of the full week of eating on a Monday, um, just to go around in a circle. We have eggs, three whole eggs, 150 grams of egg whites, 60 grams of oats with a scoop of whey protein, and some uh, sugar-free vanilla sweetener from my protein. Um, yeah, first meal of the day, coming in at quarter to three. Let's see, I'm hungry. That's why I have no energy, I'm hungry. Or two, as you can see, we've got rice, ground beef, a lot of veggies to add to the volume. Um, pretty much what I've been eating throughout the week. Um, I will eventually change ground beef to grounded chicken. Um, like to try and reduce the red meat and go to more like chicken and fish so yeah for now though we keep it here bismillah So to end the full week of eating, we're gonna end off with some yogurt, your skin raspberry. Yeah, ice cream, pretty much. A good, uh, good. no macros in too hard. Um, 168 calories per 100 grams. This is 310 grams the whole tub. Uh, so that's like 500 calories, but I'm not eating the whole tub. I'm gonna eat half of it and half of it's gonna go to Zoe. Um, and this is, gonna end my day today hopefully you guys have enjoyed this full week of eating if you have give it a like as you guys see i'm very transparent on all the foods that i eat um yeah man i like to mix it up you can always call it like if it fits my macros um i don't really like to i like to keep certain meals consistent and other ones mainly lunch i like to be flexible with the, the lunch meal um but yeah some people prefer eating the same food every single day um, so they know exactly what's going into their bodies and some days they don't really have to put it into like my fitness pal because they know I've eaten this every single day and I'm losing weight steady every now and then they might like when they see the plateau they'll take away like 10 grams from oats or something um, so yeah my calories have dropped by 100 this week and cardio has also increased by an extra 50 calories of no 100 calories of cardio um, so it was 20 minutes but it's 30 minutes now but I'm aiming for like 350 calories burnt and walking is 11,000 steps um, so yeah full week eating done if you liked it give it a thumbs up if you're new to the channel subscribe any suggestions or any topics of videos you guys would like to see on this channel let me know and I will try and get it done for you 
Love life, love life, love life. Peace.